A new large-scale attack by Azerbaijan has disrupted the peace in Nagorno-Karabakh in Armenia early this morning. Major General Jalal Harutunyan, commander of the Defense Army of the Republic of Artsakh, has said that Azerbaijani forces launched an attack along the entire line of contact starting early in the morning at 7.10 a.m. on September 27. According to Harutunyan, Azerbaijani forces have been pushed back along several directions, suffering human and technical losses, in particular four helicopters, ten tanks and several attack drones. According to Artak Beklarian, the Ombudsman of the Republic of Artsakh, there are Armenian civilian casualties as a result of Azerbaijan's offensive. Early this year, in July, another offensive was initiated by Azerbaijan on the border with Armenia targeting the civilian settlements of Armenian Tapush region. As a result, Azerbaijani army suffered major losses, including a general of the army. People of Azerbaijan took to the streets demanding a large-scale war with Armenia, but later the protest took a different turn. Demonstrators started attacking the parliament building in Baku, following which the demonstration was interrupted with the use of police brutality. Social media is shut down in Azerbaijan. In Armenia, Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan announced that by the decision of the government, martial law and general mobilization will be declared in Armenia. The decision will enter into force once it is publicized. The escalation on the line of contact continues.